Hello everyone, my name is Arden Cal Duque and today I'm going to have my demonstration as part of my school requirements and my topic for today is all about simile and metaphor. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so before we start, may I ask everyone to please stand. Okay, let us pray. Father in heaven, thank you for this day, guys, as always, in this reprain in my name, Jesus. Amen. Amen. Good morning, class. Good morning, okay. So I will now check your attendance. I want you to say present as I call your name, okay? Okay, Bernadette, present. Paul, okay, present. James, present. Jana, okay, present. How about Kelly? Oh, she's absent, okay. So majority of us today is present, so let's give ourselves a round of applause. Okay, so, can you still remember our topic yesterday? Yes, Paul. Very good. It's all about? Yes, demonstrative pronoun. Can you give me an example of a demonstrative pronoun? Yes? Yes, very good, Bernadette. Can you use it in a sentence? Okay, very good. So, I think you can still remember our topic yesterday. Are you ready for our new topic today? Okay, so before we start into our new topic, I'm going to divide you into two groups. Okay, I want you to count one and two. Okay, one, two. Okay, so all of number one will be in here and the number two will be in here. So this will be the group one and this will be the group two. Okay, so what I'm going to do today is we're going to complete the lyrics. Of a song fireworks by Katy Perry it is familiar to you okay if that's so that's great okay so I want you to complete the lyrics to fill in the missing lyrics and you're going to sing it in front by a group okay the group who has completed all the lyrics correctly is the winner is that clear okay so let's start okay I think the group one is already finished how about the group two Still doing okay. Take your time, group two. Oh, I think the group is already finished. So I think the first one to perform is the group two. Okay, so can you sing it in front? Yes, okay. Okay, very good, group two. Let's give them a round of applause. How about the group one? Are you ready? Okay, come here, group one. Okay, very good, group one. Let's give them a round of applause. So I think my students are really a great singer. Yes, you sound fireworks really well. So it's not to check your lyrics if it is correct. Okay, so I want you to exchange your paper into the next group and let's check your lyrics. Okay, so here is the cor correct lyrics in front. Okay, so who got all the lyrics correct? How about the group one? They got what? Two mistake. How about the group two? Okay, that's one mistake. I think the group two wins for today. So let's give them a round of applause. Congratulations, group two. Very good. Okay, so I want you to go back into your proper seats. Okay. Okay, arrange your chairs properly. Yes, yes, okay. So today let's watch another video. I want you to stay quiet and I want you to take down notes what is shown in the video. Is that clear? Okay. Okay, so let's start our video. Yes, okay. Here is the video.
Okay, very good. I think everyone already take down their notes. So what is the video all about? Yes, Bernadette. Very good. It's all about okay, family and metaphor. What else? Yes, Paul. Yes, it is a comparison of yes, two things. What else? Oh, the use of as and like yes very good and direct comparison yes correct very good James okay so do you already have an idea what is our topic for today very good our topic for today is simile and metaphor okay so before anything else I want you to read our objective for today okay I want us to read together Okay, so here is our objective. At the end of the lesson, okay, okay, very good, yes, okay, that's great. So, who among you have prior knowledge about simile and metaphor? Anyone? Okay, very good, yes, okay, okay, how about this one? This group. Okay, very good, Bernadette. So, I have here two sentences. I want us to read together the first sentence, okay? Kyle's life is like a roller coaster. Okay, very good. How about number two? Kyle's life is a roller coaster. So, what did you, what did you observe in these two sentences? Yes, James. Very good. The first sentence uses like and the second one doesn't use like. Oh, very good. That's correct. How about yes, Paul? Very good. The first sentence is an example of a simile and the next sentence is the best example of a metaphor. Very good. So, do you already have an idea about simile and metaphor? Okay, just like what is shown in the video, simile is comparison of two things, okay? And it uses as and like. Very good. So when we say simile, it, has, it is a comparison or the two things are directly compared and as and like is usually used to compare okay you need to take it down into your notes okay okay so simile is where two things are directly compared and as yes as and like or like is usually used to compare okay that is an example of a simile very good so why do we use simile simile is also used in poems to emphasize in point for example he ran quickly so in poem you need to be artistic right so instead of saying he ran quickly you can use that you can use a simile to that sentence like he ran as fast as cheetah okay so it, it sounded nice and artistic right okay I think they think really do you really think that okay so he ran as fast as cheetah instead of saying he ran quickly okay so it means he is compared into the cheetah okay yes because he ran quickly very good okay so okay another example of simile i have here is he was slow like a snail okay so 
what do you notice? Yes, very good, Bernadette. I have used the word like. So, he was a slow, like a snail. So, I have compared him into a snail, which is very slow. Have you seen a snail? Yes, the snail walks really slow like this. And you're going to fall asleep when you watch the snail when you wait for the snail to walk, right? So he is compared to a snail, which he is very slow. Very good. The next one is as cold as a dog's nose. So I compared something into a dog's nose. Have you touched the dog's nose? Yes, the dog the nose of the dog is cold, right? So I compared him, I, I, I have compared something into a into that dog's nose which is cold very good and that is example of a simile because i have used the word yes as okay so remember this when you use the word as and like in, in comparison of two things it is an example of a simile very good how about the metaphor okay so a metaphor metaphor also compares two things yes just like simile Metaphor also compares two things, but, but, it doesn't use as and like. Okay? So remember this, simile uses as and like. However, in metaphor, it doesn't use as and like. Okay? For example, I have here. You've got the smile that lights up the room. Okay? You've got a smile that lights up the room. Okay, so I have compared... A smile and the light because it lights up the room very good so I didn't use the word as and like very good so another example stop you snake okay so what it is correct yes very good so I have compared him into a snake but I didn't use as and like it's a direct comparison okay and that is an example of a very good metaphor. Okay, so I think you already understand the simile and metaphor. So I want everyone to to give an example of a simile. Okay? Simile. Yes, James. Very good. How about Bernadette? What? Your carpet is as green as the grass. Very good. Hugh says she grass us into the grass okay the carpet and the grass how about jana okay she is hot like a charcoal a charcoal okay that's pretty good that's a pretty good example of a simile how about the metaphor remember guys metaphor doesn't use us and like right okay i want any volunteer okay yes James. Okay. James and uh, Paul is burning hot and crispy. Okay, that's great example of my metaphor. How about anyone? Okay, yes. Okay, that's pretty good example of a metaphor. Very good. So I think you already understand our topic for today. So always remember this guys when you use simile, when we say simile. It is it is there it is used to compare two things, but it uses as and like while metaphor, yes, it is also used to compare two things, but it doesn't use okay as and like. Very good. Okay, so right now let's have another activity. Okay, I want every one of you to get back into your group. The group one and the group two. Okay. Okay, so are you ready? Okay, so what we're going to do today is you are going to choose four similes in four metaphor into the song of Katy Perry's Firework. And you're going to write that in front in the blackboard. Yes. So each member should write one example of a simile or a metaphor that is found in the lyrics, fireworks of Katy Perry. Okay, so the first group who will first finish the four examples of the simile and the four examples of the metaphor from the lyrics of Katy Perry's Firework wins. Okay? Okay, so are you ready? Okay, I think the group one is ready. How about the group two? Okay, very good. So, 
Let's start. Okay, I think the group one is done. Okay, so let's check your work. Okay, so the group two got all the examples correct. Very good, group two. Let's give them a round of applause. How about the group one? Okay, they got all the examples correct. Let's give them a round of applause. Okay, but I said earlier, the first group to finish wins. So, the winner for today is the group two. Yay! Let's give them a round of applause. Very good, group two. Okay, so better luck next time. Group one, I want you to be prepared next for the next activity tomorrow. Okay? Okay, so I think you already understand our topic for today. So for your assignment, I want you to write a poem using the examples of simile and metaphor and use the template here in front in which I am. Okay? Okay, use this template. And this will be submitted tomorrow. Okay, I'm going to collect this tomorrow. Okay, so... Okay, so, do you understand? Okay, do you have any questions? Okay, so let us all stand if you, have, if you don't have any question. Okay, let's bow down our head and let us pray. Okay, thank you for this day, Lord God. Thank you for the learning. In this name of Jesus, Amen. Amen. So, goodbye, class. Okay, goodbye. See you tomorrow, okay? Don't forget to bring your assignment. Okay, bye-bye. Hello guys, thank you for watching in my demonstration. If you like my demonstration, comment and like below. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you!